Okay, welcome to another installment of Aliverse Action Force Covert Customs. And we are winding down here with the current complement of figures I possess. Uh, I have moved all the Series 3 Divas and taken their parts and put them just off camera uh, for now. I'm still holding out on uh, getting started on those until the next wave of Action Force products is released. So I can use some of those products when I customize those parts. Uh, meanwhile, I've gone ahead and uh, gathered together some parts that I think will be suitable action figures on the table here. And today we're going to have a look at Convoy. And once again, I feel like the code name itself uh, tells you everything you need to know about the action figure. He is a driver. Okay. He is a, a highly desired driver because of his almost uh, sixth sense ability in avoiding IEDs. And uh, that's uh, the first part of his backstory. Uh, I'm developing it even further. Uh, in civilian life, he doesn't like to drive because, you know, driving uh, military vehicles in the, middle, in the Middle East, extremely stressful. So in civilian life, he, he, doesn't, he doesn't even own a car. He takes the bus and the subway or walks wherever he needs to go. But uh, in action force, this is going to be, if, they, if he produces the... Um, uh, the Vanguard Resvani vehicle. This will probably be my driver right here because that's his role in Action Force. And uh, we'll go down the parts list here. Um, again, shrinking amount of parts to work with. Uh, every one of these figures is going to have a little duster in them, okay? So we've got uh, Blowback's head, the Balaclava head, Desert Rat's torso, Duster's arms. These are probably Desert Rat's hands. Uh, sort of lost track of all the different hands between Desert Rat, Karak, Sergeant Slaughter, and any others that have bare hands, okay? Uh, the legs are from Condor, Series 1, and the boots are from Blowback from the Special Deployment Series. That's all the, the body parts. The helmet and the plate carriers from the Infantry Commando, as is the med pack. I think that all looks good together, but the uh, belt here with the holster is from Duster. And I think this all goes together quite well. Even the blue stripes. So that is, I, my, my fear was that blue stripe as a result of using Duster's arm is going to clash. You know, it, it doesn't. And that might clash on that one. But we'll, we're will we going to have some fun with that one. But uh, it's fine. Um, it's this. He looks like a, a modern soldier, pals. And that's the aesthetic I was going for here. We've got a small khaki backpack and shoulder bag from the backpack gear set. That goes quite well with the infantry commandos. Uh, accessories. As far as hardware, uh, you can't see the knife right now, but that is not uh, the standard knife that comes in one of these plate carriers. It's from the uh, Crimson Shadows Arsenal 10. Uh, it's molded in the same design as the uh, uh, Swarm Troopers knife and the Steel Brigade's knife, except it's got a green hilt on it, okay? I thought that looked good with this. It's just a duster sidearm there. Still got plenty of those to use. And this is from a gear set, this, uh, this long arm. I think that looks really good. And so there you go. That's that's Convoy. That's a rundown. And like I said, if the uh, if the Resvani Vanguard or the tank or whatever it's going to be called uh, goes in the production, uh, then we'll... Uh, the, I've seen the prototypes, the, uh, the, the resin prototypes. It looks awesome. So if that's produced, if it doesn't cost too much, uh, we're going to put it in the... Uh, we're going to put this guy as the, as the driver. That probably give him some duster gloves at that point. Uh, some cradle gloves to hold the steering wheel with. Oh no, gripping gloves will probably hold the steering wheel much better on those. That's that's a long way ahead, folks. I'm just looking ahead at this point, but yeah, this is a convoy. And uh that's it. I think that's a pretty cool codename if you're if you if you're a fan of the Transformers, uh, you may be saying to yourselves, "Wait a minute, isn't that Optimus Prime's name in Japan?" Well, yeah, it is, but it's also a word, convoy, and it's a military term. So there you go. Uh again, I feel like the code name tells you everything you need to know about the action figure, and I dig that. Okay, well, thank you so much for watching, pals, and I'll talk to you again real soon. Take care.